Okay, we verified that the uh, timer's working. Alright, pressure over there is normal. Pressure over there is normal. 180. We had a little too much pressure in the boiler from a cold start, like 50 degrees. We had it up to like 18 or so, so the gauge was getting up to about 30. So we, we blew some pressure down out of the uh, boiler bypass there and just blew it into this bucket, which is now steaming away. A little up your humidity in here a little bit at least. Yeah. <laughs> this bucket's steaming like crazy. Yeah, I'll bet. <laughs> so I'm going to pipe yeah. that pressure release valve first thing tomorrow then. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. So we operating within normal parameters now. It seems so. There's the fire still cooking away. Woo! Man, that's hot. It's starting to finally drop some ash, so we're at normal running conditions now. That noise doesn't seem to be the motor. It seems to be you go over closer to the gearbox, but it's not the gearbox either. It's like between the gearbox and the motor somehow. Yeah, it's probably the coupler. I don't know if I'm just used to it now or what, but it's, it seems quieter to me than it did before. Yeah. So it did come up to 180 and shut down, and yep. the timer ran and. Four and a half. Once it uh, hit the high limit on the timer, it shut off, so it should be pretty good to go. The draft is about 0.045. Not enough to pull the parametric dampener open yet, but... I don't even know where that's set. Yep. That's it. Successful install.